Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescaserakes.com coming at you with 2022 Leaf Stitches and Slabs. Baseball, three box, random hit break number two. So each box has a jersey and a slab. Stitches and slabs. Snitches get stitches and slabs, as, uh, as they say on the streets. Big thanks to Carl for getting a couple spots straight up. And congrats again to the winners of spots here in that select baseball pack break. So we're going to open up the box, and um, we'll go slab jersey, slab jersey, slab jersey. So we'll type all those in, then we'll randomize you a hit. There it is. a little room here. We're going to slide these two boxes just off to the side. You can still see those boxes on, uh, on my face camera right here. Camera one. All right. The slab is here. Ooh, this is a great time to get this guy. PSA 10, Adley Rushman from 2019 Bowman Draft. It's a Bowman first and a PSA 10. Just got called up a couple days ago, yesterday, two days ago. I don't know, the days are blurring together. Um, but I think, I want to say his debut featured a triple. I think his first hit was a triple. Yeah. It was, right? Yeah. And that guy's going to be that guy's going to be a stud. A a switch hitting, power hitting catcher? Yeah. What? Ooh. Ooh. All right, let me type in that hit. Yeah, he gets his first career home run in the Bronx, too. Oh, man. In some that's that's good. Good signs for him. Yeah. So the Adley Rushman PSA 10, I'll type that in here. All right, and the jersey, should we play a little Who Am I with the jersey? I think you can kind of see the color of the jersey on the top camera, let me turn that off temporarily. All right. I don't think we don't, we don't have any breaks sold out after this, so we can take a little time with this one. Um, who am I? You saw the color of the jersey. You maybe saw the number. You may know who that is. A two-time silver slugger and a one-time all-star in my short three-year career. In three years, I've got a career 292 batting average, 81 home runs, 300 hits, 52 stolen bases, almost 200 RBIs, an OPS of 965. Career OPS of 965. Have not, has not made a start this season. Because uh, I like to ride motorcycles in the off season, and, uh, and and break my wrists. Who am I? Yep, yeah, Oliver's got it. Fernando Tatis Jr. There's his autograph right there. You got the, your JSA sticker and and tags. Right, these are custom jerseys, not officially licensed, so we'll just leave it nicely folded in here for now. All right, next one. Oh, 
Oliver is asking if Nelson Cruz goes 500 homers, is he, is he a Hall of Famer? Yeah, that, that's a good milestone number. Uh, I mean, how many 500 home run hitters are not Hall of Famers? All right. Oh, this is a classic here. PSA 10, 1989 Topps Baseball, traded. Ken Griffey Jr. That is nice. Let's type that hit in. So zero. Every every player who has at least 500 home runs is a Hall of Famer. Cruz has 456. If he hits 500, I don't know if he'll be first ballot. Maybe we'll have to look at the numbers a little more closely. May not be first ballot, but eventually you'll have to get in, I feel. If that's the trend. Mm. Who am I? America's favorite game. Um... I have a lifetime 279 batting average, 11 home runs, 55 RBI, 6 stolen bases. Finished third in Rookie of the Year voting in 2021. He's pretty good. His, this season, 261, 4 home runs, 16 RBIs, 4 stolen bases, an OPS of 700, 702. I think he's... He's putting up those numbers a little banged up, too. Shortstop could play some third, too. Switch hitter throws uh, as a right. Probably one of the better, uh, probably one of the best young hitters that we're going to see, that, that we see. Not Bo Bichette. He's nicknamed El Patron, apparently. Yeah, he was a top international prospect in the 2017 international class. In 2018, hit for the cycle while playing for the Princeton minor league team. In 2018, at only 17 years old, I was named the 2018 Appalachian League Player of the Year after slashing 374, 445, and 636. 11 home runs, 57 runs batted in. Prior to 2019, I was ranked the fourth best prospect by Baseball America. Named to the 2019 All-Star Futures Game, finished 2019, 327, 398, 487 slash line with nine home runs and 53 RBIs. Prior to 2020, was ranked the number one prospect in all of baseball. And then this team added me to their uh, player pool of players who would be eligible to play in the MLB postseason, but I did not appear in an MLB game. And then this uh, last year in 2021, didn't make the team, started with the AAA Durham Bulls. And then I think was finally uh, finally called up in 2020, or officially, or played a little late in 2021. Signed an 11-year, $182 million extension in November of last year. And then has hit the ground running this season. There you go, Oliver. Wander Franco. Putting up great numbers. It's got stickers in the way, but there's Zotto right there. You got the JSA sticker, I'm sure. There you go. Behind the card. Got the JSA card as well. Nice clean jersey. Nice clean autograph. Awesome. 
All right, and the third and final box, two more hits. We got a a Beckett slab here. It's a ten. No, no auto. And it is Ichiro Suzuki. Wow, nice. It's an authentic autograph. Oh, the autograph is a 10. From 2001 Upper Deck. Nice. the final jersey. Let's see what we got. Let's see who we got here. All right. I am a retired outfielder, first baseman, third baseman, switch hitter, throws right. I was a lot of accolades here. I was an MVP. I was Rookie of the Year, a 17-time All-Star, won three World Series, two-time Gold Glover, a Silver Slugger, three-time Batting Title um, Award winner, World Series MVP. My last game was uh, at 45 years old. My last game was August 17th, 1986. Career 300 hitter, 303. 160 home runs, over 1,300 RBIs, almost 200 stolen bases. But uh, not a Hall of Famer with all those accolades. And played, played 24 years, 19 years with one team, five years with another team. And then in between somewhere, oh, when he was traded, he spent a, like half a season with, with the Expos. I didn't realize that before going back to his original team. I'm going to give you one stat that's going to that's going to give it away. Um, I'm going to give you one stat that's going to give it away. I have four thousand two hundred and fifty-six hits. Oh, there you go. Patrick got it, I think, even before I gave that, that crucial clue. Terry, what's going on? It is indeed P. Rose. Good job, Patrick. There you go. Pete Rose. Commemorating his hits right there as well. Now, I didn't realize... Well, so he was in Cincinnati for ages, then went to Philadelphia for a little while and it looks I guess Philadelphia traded him to Montreal maybe signed with Montreal after yeah I'll have, to, I'll have to look that up a little bit later but it looks like he played his last year in Philadelphia went to Montreal maybe he was traded and then spent half a season there before I guess being traded to Cincinnati it looks like and then spent a couple more seasons there before hanging it up all right Let's flip back over here. Yeah, we've done a lot of jersey breaks. We just haven't had a lot available recently. But we'll, we'll, we'll dig up some more. Oliver has a Montreal Pete Rose autograph. So there, there are the hits. One, two, three, four, five, six. Once again, big thanks to this group here. Let's roll it and randomize it and see which hit you're going to get. Four and a one, five times for both lists. One, your name's first. Two, three, four, and five. Got Josh down to John Stacy. Four and a one, five times for the hits. One. 
Good luck. Two, three, four, and a one. Fifth and final time, fingers crossed. We got Ken Griffey Jr. down to Wander Franco. I think there's some really nice hits popping out of this leaf break. So thanks everyone. So there you have it, Josh, with the Ken Griffey Jr. 1989 Topps Baseball Card PSA 10. Carl with the Adley Rushman PSA 10. That's a nice one. Steve Locke, you got the Pete Rose autograph jersey. Carl with the Ichiro. Nice autograph card. Uh, autograph grade 10. Bennett with the Fernando Tatis Jr. autograph jersey. And John with the Wander Franco autograph jersey. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Thanks for watching. Thanks for breaking with us. And I'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.